this tripped me out. I don't know. I've been wanting to talk to you about this for a couple of years now because I just kind of came to this realization, right? That when you track your career in WWE, you hit that where you're the guy and then you lose to The Rock at WrestleMania, which a lot of people would not want to do in the position that you were in. You get your victory back in the main event the next year. And the part that tripped me out was it's the last WrestleMania main event that you got. You didn't main event WrestleMania after that. A lot of people hold on to that spot and go, no, 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 no. Like, I'm not, I'm I'm main eventing, I'm main eventing, I'm going to win, I'm going to win. And it's not something that you ever did. Is that just not, did it never occur to you? Not once. That is not how I operate. Mm-hmm. And I try to instill that mindset in young performers of you can, you can waste your time in jockeying for a position. And... You can use your time. I don't want to say it's a waste because it's worked successfully for people. Or you can just get your opportunities and make the best of them. Hey, we need you to do a Firefly Funhouse match. What's that? I don't know. All right, let's get weird. (laughs) Uh, We need you to build a WrestleMania program with The Undertaker. He's never going to be there. And by the way, for the first half of the show, you got to be a fan. No problem. How does that work? I don't know. Uh, You just talked about a wonderful moment in MetLife Stadium. Yeah. I was on first this year. Yeah. Yeah, you were. Yeah. Hey, okay. And, and by wanna... the way, if you're keeping score, I finished second place. <laughs> and you don't need to be the last match. I had a hell of a career after the Met Life thing. Like, I don't you don't need to be last. Nobody remembers that you didn't main event. Like that's what I mean. Like I had to think about the oh my God, he didn't main event after yeah. that. It's not a thing. And I think it was what did I do next? Bray? Bray. And then I won the U.S. title. Yeah. Rusev. How many people do that? Right. Like Steve Austin in his heyday. And I love Steve. But like, hey, Steve, I know you just won in Houston. And you got the, you, got the, you know, you got the strap. <laughs> uh, what do you think about winning the U.S. title from, yeah. from, a, from a guy we, we might have something out of? I don't know. I don't think so. Maybe, maybe not. Right. But I just, I was, just get me on the field. I don't care what it is. Just get me out there. There's something else I've wanted to ask you about forever when you talk about- And again, that's only my perspective. Sure. Like I say, like, there is no wrong. So I don't think the other way is a waste of time, but I do know that I've gotten 20 years worth of moments with this philosophy. 